Hello! In this video, I'm going to show you guys how to export multiple grids from LeapFrog to Groundwater Vistas. I'm Vito Vieira Centeno, I'm a technical support analyst here at Sequent. I have here my structure grid. I'm going to show you guys how to do this for both structured and unstructured grids. So this is my structure grids, my structure grid, uh, and as you can see, we have a bunch of hydraulic properties assigned to it. So we can see those hydraulic properties here. This is KX, KY, SS, SY, and so on. To bring that into Groundwater Vistas, the process is actually very simple. I right-click on the structure grid on my project tree, and then I select Export to Multiflow. Then I save this somewhere on my computer. Open Groundwater Vistas. So I go to File, New, Quadrado Vistas document, press OK, and then I go to Multiflow at the bottom left corner. I browse for my NAM file that I saved before and click OK. That's it. It's a very simple process. So if I go here to my hydraulic connectivity, you guys can see that all my data is here. All my values are nicely here. So all my Values are here. Now for unstructured grids, the this is the unstructured grid that we are going to bring into Contrary Vistas. So here is our model. As you can see, also has a bunch of hydraulic properties assigned to it, um, which you can visualize here. This is KX, KZ, SS, SY, and so on. You will click right click on the structure grid. Uh, so let's export to Mudflow and you save it somewhere on your computer. Open from to other vistas. So I go to new from to other vistas FE document. Click OK. I'll click on import at the bottom left corner. And then I'm going to unstructure grid. Look for my Mudflow simulation. GSF file, which was created during that leapfrog export. Then I click OK. The file does not contain a quadrature representation, so I'm going to click No. Yeah, we click Yes. Click OK here. Now here's my grid. However, there is an issue here. I don't have my values. You can look here at the bottom left corner of my screen if I hover the mouse. This is not what I had in my leapfrog model. Props, property values, database. That's definitely, I didn't have this. But we are missing a knowledge step that is necessary for a structured grid. Click File, Import, Mudflow USG name file, and then you select the name file. That's an extra step that you need to do compared to bringing uh, structured grids. You don't need to do this for structured grids, just for unstructured ones. Click open, click OK, and there you go. Now I have all my hydraulic properties for that I created only prop. Here's my hydraulic connectivity, bottom left of the screen here. Here's the metrics of all those values. These are all here. That's how you should bring uh, structured and unstructured multiflow grids from LeapFrog to Conjure the Vistas. Uh, thank you very much. And if you have any further questions, please reach out to support at sequence.com.